On this episode of China Uncensored, China is a twit about Twitter. Hi. Welcome to China Uncensored. I'm Chris Chappell. You know, there's a funny habit oppressive regimes always seem to share. They tend to indulge in the same things they forbid the people from having, and sometimes it backfires, especially when it has to do with computers, because computers are hard. That's what someone at China's state-run Xinhua news agency found out when he tried to post a tweet. You see, China has some pretty strict internet censorship. That's why you can't get on Facebook in China. You might see something subversive, but you're also not allowed to get on Twitter, which might make you think why state-run Xinhua News Agency even has a Twitter account to begin with. But then, really, who told you to think? So here's a tweet by a twit at Xinhua. He's answering a question about why the account hasn't been active, and whoever asked that question better not have been in China. Basically, the old account manager quit and didn't tell anyone how to get around the internet blockade. That was the first post since 2011, but that hasn't stopped Xinhua from setting up a fully functional English language Twitter account. So, if they only have a functioning English account and you aren't allowed to go on Twitter in China, who are they really talking to? Over the past few years, China has pumped billions of dollars into foreign language media campaigns. For example. A 40 by 60 foot LED, 24 hours a day, seven days a week, 365 days a year. Ad for Xinhua in the center of New York's Times Square. And so, while the rest of the world is talking about China's rampant corruption, political infighting, and atrocious human rights record, if you go to the official source for China news, you get stories like this about Chinese leader Xi Jinping. He also has dreamy eyes. So. If you want real China news in 160 characters or less, forget Xinhua. Check out my Twitter account. Or if you still want fake China news, just go to the relevant organs. Their fake China news is way better than Xinhua's fake China news. Thanks for watching this episode of China Uncensored. Once again, I'm Chris Chappell. See you next time.